We need to pray for this country. We need to pray for our leadership. Thank you, Jesus. So our leadership is also very important. Yes, our own leadership here is very important. There is a man that we needed we need to cover, but I don't know whether I should mention his name. He's a local person here in politics, but you see, you can notice that I'm very comfortable mentioning other people, other countries, but when it comes to here, <laughs> because if I keep quiet, who loses? It's you. Hmm? But there's a very prominent person in politics that we need to pray for. Because I see something entering into his stomach. Vomiting, 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 vomiting. At first it's food. At the end it is blood. And he's in the hospital. Only prayers can save this man. And the man has been so loyal. Loyal. To his authorities. To his authority. We need to pray for this country. We need to pray for our leadership. Thank you, Jesus. So our leadership is also very important. Yes, our own leadership here is very important. There's a man that we needed we need to cover, but I don't know whether I should mention his name. He's a local person here in politics. But you see,
you see, you can notice that I'm very comfortable mentioning other people, other countries, but when it comes to here, because if I keep quiet, who loses? It's you. And But there's a very prominent person in politics that we need to pray for. Because I see something entering into his stomach. Vomiting, 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 vomiting. At first it's food. At the end it is blood. And he's in the hospital. Only prayers can save this man. The man has been so loyal. Loyal to his authorities. To his authority.
leaked over the weekend that he was poisoned at a rally in Gwanda. It's believed Mnangagwa was taken out of the country in the company of his wife, Oxilla, last night. Weekend reports said the deputy president was rushed to a hospital in Gweru first after he started vomiting while attending President Robert Mugabe's rally in Gwanda. Well, for more, let's cross our reporter, Dumala Mahlade, who's at the Donald Gordon Medical Center in Parktown in Johannesburg. Uh, Dumala, thanks for joining us. What, what do we know at this stage? Well, thank you, Francis. Uh, at this stage, it, details remain uh, sketchy apart uh, from the picture that you just painted there from the intro. However, what we can confirm is that uh, President Robert Mugabe has confirmed that um, Nangagwa is in Johannesburg uh, for treatment. Now, Mugabe was addressing a hero's rally uh, in Harare at Hero's Acre when he made the statement. So uh, the Zimbabwean government there through President Mugabe confirming that indeed Nangagwa is, uh, being, uh, is receiving treatment here in uh, Johannesburg. Vice President Komre Emerson Mnangagwa is not back yet from hospital in Johannesburg. Health and Child Care Minister Dr. David Parrenyatwa has cleared the air following a health scare suffered by Vice President Comrade Emerson Mnangagwa, saying the nation must not panic because the Vice President is recovering well and is in a stable condition, though still in hospital. Dr. Parrenyatwa was speaking during a media briefing where he was in the campaign of Information, Media and Broadcasting Services Minister Dr. Christopher Mshowe in the capital this Monday. Dr. Parrenyatwa said Comrade Mnangagwa had severe stomach pains during the Youth Interface Rally. He's much improved. In fact, we just spoke with him. He's quite jovial and he's, he's well, really. Um, but uh, he requested and we have sent him to be seen by his doctors in South Africa, where he is now. Uh, you are all aware that he had uh, a severe bout of, uh, of vomiting and, and diarrhea uh, in Rwanda, and uh, we took him to appropriate institutions within the country where he was uh, properly stabilized, and uh, um, uh, appropriate investigations were then commenced. We are still uh, in progress. The appropriate investigations to establish the source uh, of that uh, um, uh, gastroenteritis or vomiting and diarrhea. Dr. Parinyatwa also said Zimbabweans will continue to be updated on the condition of Vice President Comrade Munangagwa. So over the weekend that he was poisoned at a rally in Gwanda. It's believed Munangagwa... Because I see something entering into his stomach. Weekend reports said the deputy president was rushed to a hospital in Gweru first after he started vomiting. Vomiting, 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 vomiting. At first, it's food. At the end, it is blood. Vice President Komre Emerson Mnangagwa is not back yet from hospital in Johannesburg. Weekend reports said the deputy president was rushed to a hospital. And he's in the hospital. And the man has been so loyal. Lawyer to his authorities, to his authority.
Only prayers can save this man. In a matter of cheating, bring a ticket to the table. Go, 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 go